Welcome to our channel. We are Technic Force and we help grow your business online. Please hit the subscribe button to get more updates. X Direct Messaging Businesses can use X to provide customer service to their customers. Direct messaging will make conversations private and can only be seen by the two users who send the direct message and the person receiving the message. By default, not anyone on X can send you a direct message. Only your followers can send you a direct message on X unless you edit this setting on X. In this lesson, we're going to talk about X direct messaging. Let's get started. Direct messaging or DM on X, formerly Twitter, is a private communication feature that allows you to send messages directly to other users without making it public. It's a great way to connect, network, and build relationships one-on-one. -on -one. X Inbox Your X Inbox is where all your received messages are stored. It has two main sections. One is Messages, where you can see conversations with people you follow or who follow you. Message Requests you also have here message requests. What are message requests? Message requests are messages sent by people who don't follow you and who follow you, but you don't follow them back. They appear in a separate tab and you can choose to accept to move it to your inbox or decline to ignore or delete. Accepting a request allows further communication. How to send a direct message. To send a direct message, go to x.com in a web browser. If you're not already signed into your account, you'll be prompted to do so now. Click the Messages tab. It's the envelope icon in the left panel. If your browser window is large enough, you'll see the word Messages next to the envelope at the right side. You can also send a message to someone by clicking the envelope icon at the top of their X profile. If you don't see an envelope icon, it's usually because the person isn't following you. Some people allow DMs from all X users, but others only allow them from people they follow. Once you're here, click New Message at the right side. It's the oval button at the center of the right panel. This brings up a window with their most contacted people. If you don't see the New Message button, click the envelope with a plus sign at the top right corner of the Messages box. To reply to an existing message, click it in the center panel. You can then type your reply into the Start a New Message field at the bottom and press Enter or Return to send it. Going back here, if you click this message icon at the top, this will appear. Type the name or username of the person you want to message. This displays any matching search results. You'll also see a list of suggested users. Click the name of the person you want to write. This adds that person to the recipient list at the top of the window. To send the message to multiple people, click Create a Group and select the users you want to add. Continue adding recipients by clicking their names. A group message can have up to 100 users. Once done, click on Next. It's the top right corner of the window. Type your message into the field at the bottom of the window. In addition to typing standard text, you can click the smiley face icon to add emoji. To attach a photo or video to the message, click the photo icon at the messages bottom and select one from your computer. If you'd like to attach a GIF, click GIF and search for one to send. Click the send icon to send the message. It's a small paper airplane at the bottom right corner. This sends the message to the selected recipients. Right here is where you can see settings. If you click on it, here you will see allow message requests from no one, verified users, and everyone. Also, people you follow will always be able to message you. If you choose no one, no one can message you. If you choose verified users, only verified users can message you. And if you choose everyone, everyone can message you. So let's choose everyone. Then right here, you can see filter low quality messages. If you opted in, meaning you agreed to hide message requests that have been detected as being potentially spam or low quality. These will be sent to a separate inbox at the bottom of your message request. You can still access them if you want. Basically, it will detect if it might be a bot or a spam and it won't send it to you. But if you want to get everything, you can toggle this off as well. And then every DM that comes your way, you will receive in your inbox. And then down here, show read receipt. If you opted in, meaning you let people you're messaging with know when you've seen their messages. How to start a conversation with your prospects on X. 
First is personalize your message. Avoid generic greetings. Mention something specific about their profile, tweets, or business. Example, hi, put their name. I saw your recent post about the topic, great insights. I'd love to connect and share some thoughts about the related topic. Second is be concise. Keep your message short and to the point. Prospects are more likely to respond to a clear, value-driven message. Example, hi, put the name. I admire your work in this field. I'd love to discuss how we can collaborate on a specific project or idea. The third one is offer value first. Share a resource, tip, or solution they might find useful before pitching your idea. Example, hi, put his or her name. I notice you're interested in this topic. Here's a free tool I use that could help. And then put the link and then say, let me know what you think. The fourth one is ask an open-ended question. Prompt engagement by asking a relevant question about their needs or goals. Example, what's your biggest challenge with this specific topic? I'd be happy to share insights that might help. The last one is be genuine and respectful. Avoid being overly salesy and focus on building a relationship first. If you're reaching out to many prospects, create a template but customize key details for each person to avoid sounding robotic. Using DMs strategically can turn casual conversations into meaningful connections and opportunities. Introducing people bots. People bots is your entire online sales support and coaching team. PeopleBots will learn your business and sell, support, and train for you. It can chat. It can even speak to your prospects. It can work 24-7 with no breaks and help you grow your business and get you happier customers. PeopleBots is the advanced AI website chat that your business needs today. It can be anyone you want it to be. It can learn and remember everything. Just give it instruction manuals, your knowledge base, or write a little document that tells everything PeopleBots need to know. PeopleBots help you sell support, coach, speak. It can even work with human teammates. It will help you get leads and people bots learn continuously. People bots can spark up the conversation by sending your customer a message. People bots can integrate perfectly with your website's design. It can speak every language. It can also keep records of all chats. Like I told you earlier, you can customize PeopleBot's knowledge and personality, but that's not all. You can create many versions. You can create multiple bots, each with a different expertise and information to integrate on different websites or web pages. It has ready-made bots for you to use. No need to plug in your AI or bring in your API keys. Integrate PeopleBots in any web page in less than two minutes. And a lot more. So what are you waiting for? Get PeopleBots now. Just go to getpeoplebots.in. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more content, and ring that notification bell. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.